Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Heavily Modded Heavenly Island. Where, if I actually had, you know, this not full screen, you guys could see whether the uh, microphone volume was spazzing about, but... Let's see what's going on here. Are you behaving a bit more now? You are, but I think... We'll do something like that. So that they don't have to go into a roundabout as much, and... No, just get out of this. You guys should all be either wanting to go straight on, which isn't an option. Oh, it is an option for this, yeah. And anyone who wants to come down here should already be turning off. Okay, that roundabout doesn't work as well as I would hoped it would have. And this road? <laughs> Guys, there's a train here. Don't carry the trucks through this scary mountain pass. Use a sodding train. Because there's little I can do to make this road more dense. It's, yeah, I'm surprised I even got that to fit. Why don't you upgrade all major roads instead of keep adding connections to that giant roundabout? It looks huge, like a huge bad traffic jam. Um, part of the reason that this isn't working as well is just that it's the roundabout goes the wrong way. Nick, why is the overlay still on? Because I'm an idiot. Nick, I know how to fix a road problem. Just build the magic roundabout. That's not actually a terrible idea. Um, ladies and gentlemen, there is a... Just in case you're thinking, you know, it's weird and whatever. Uh, the magic roundabout is an actual term. It means uh, the entrance of every... Of, uh, a big roundabout with its entrances being mini roundabouts. But I don't know if I've got room. And I sort of like this now. It's bad, but I do sort of like it. And I, I like the idea of having a spaghetti junction. <laughs> and so because of that, I, I just feel like adding more and more spaghetti to it. <laughs> this junction will be a mess. We'll try for better on other ones. If City Skylines had tunnels, I imagine it would be easier. Oh crap, the overlay's still on. Uh, I'm not sure, because all it would do is give you the... Uh, the exact same that you can do now. You can build multiple heights. I guess what it would do is mean that you wouldn't have to have as long a run-up to get, like, to, say, a height 2 or a height 3 to get over, because you could just go down one height and still keep the... Change... Some of the directions on the roundabout as you have none of them set for right turn if you have to go all the way around. I have some that do right turns. I mean, like, if you come up here, that's effectively a right turn. That's a right turn. Oh, this is working. I'm going to ignore that because it's behaving. Buy new land. Not yet. Instead, let's try and come up with some more residential squeezed in down here. And then might as well connect you there, you up here. Is that's not that much room for residential, but it's squeezing the stuff in first, which is what I'm more bothered about. You all need to be offices. I can probably get away with some residential on the inside of that. But yeah, we need zoning here, and I don't want 
that and this connecting. So whatever I build here is going to have to be separate. We want lots of residential. So say coming off here. And off here. And I don't really want to get too, too close to this. But there as well. There should be some good starting lines for some more flexi roads. Actually, that does want to be straight. Then just a nice straight line out there. Because everyone wants to be built building near the railroad tracks. Could you say that all of this is being built on the wrong side of the railroad tracks? And now for some curvy tools. It's a bit far. There we go. I think just straight lines fanning out here. This is definitely not my usual style of build. Just trying to keep these areas looking distinct. There we go. I've no idea what traffic will be like on that, but let's get it zoned up and see. So high density commercial. Along this main road again. And in the middle. Um, not all of that though. Like this here, no. But you all the way up to there, yes. Then offices. Ah, didn't click in the square. At least out here. Actually, some of you need to be turned over to offices just so that you don't complain about the noise as much. <clears throat> it's also terrible little blobs, so I'd rather have them as offices than houses. But yeah, let's build more houses. Instantly starts demolishing houses. But now all of this should be able to just be turned over to residential. Which is what we need at the minute, so... See, maybe along the railroad track I'm going to want to name, uh, give it as offices. Screw this, just paint. And definitely along the edge there, actually. So let's, let's do that before I get confused and forget. Because me, confused and forget, you know, it can happen. It's a possibility. And there's plenty of little zones. Let's click into these. Probably my K tool would have been a better idea. Oh, you guys don't have water? So what, you want me to drink? I was giving you housing, not waterworks. Um. There we go, all water, all the time. Now they're going to move in and how's the traffic going to be? And although I didn't really want these connecting too, too much, let's allow for that one connection. For one, because it gives you more zoning. And two, that gets that... These offices, you know, these workplaces, closer to these guys in case they want to move in there. Hi, Mick! <laughs> I never actually thought we'd see somebody with, like, just the name Nick on Twitch, just because I would have always expected it to have been gone. You know, even back in the days of uh, Justin TV, surely Nick would have been taken. 
In fact, I know back in the days of Justin TV's, Nick was taken. Because I tried to get it. <laughs> My account back dates back to then. Okay, this crazy junction is... Sort of working. This bit here is actually bad. But... I'm amazed at how well most of that's working. Hola, bonjour. Lots of other ways to say hello. Uh, you're missing out on some zoning there, actually. So let's take... You and run you like that. And is that part covered? Did I accidentally place them with the insanity tools on? No, it's fine. It's just showing me what the potential zoning was that I've gone over. Well, streamer Nick, your accent, by the way, is the most innocent I have ever heard. You just went from water to water in one sentence. Oh, thank you for following. FIFA Dogs 101. Wait, wait, wait. FIFA Dogs 101. You are the 500th. There's nothing special for this, by the way, but I think I think this is the case. <laughs> Let me check. Follow account. Stop start. Come on. Get it. 499. Uh, it still says 499. I, I'm pretty sure it was at 499 before you followed, which should mean it's at 500. Uh, Nick, you can't read. Nope. Fine then, Scott. I'll say salut instead. Thank you for following. Dragon Studio Rant Rache. Right. If the other guy wasn't the 500th, you definitely are. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Thank you for following. Temple of Light. Definitely, definitely over. 500 now. So I think the next goal is just to meet up with the YouTube numbers of subscribers, which is going to be like 550, maybe 560 by the time we actually catch up. <laughs> Salut also means bye, yes. I do know that because I've been lazy and used it quite a lot. Even better is when you walk into a room and you just say, Salut. And they think you're meaning like, hello, and then you just walk straight back out again. <laughs> to be honest, the viewer follower ratio is amazing. Well, in my early days of YouTube, the subscriber viewer numbers was what people considered amazing. I, I used to feel bad if I didn't get at least, you know, 10... Was it 10%? Like, all the time when I was on youtube.com forward slash Dr. Nick Doom, if I didn't get, like, half of my subscribers watching, it, it felt bad. You know, it felt like I was underperforming. Then, um, House Doom won when I had to move. It was more like, uh, 10%, and that's all I stick to, and it's even worse than that now. Tristan, you missed an hour. Yes, you did. I like how, you know, people are disappointed Tristan's turned up. <laughs> But, I think when you're a younger channel, or I know technically this Twitch stream isn't a young stream, uh, but, you know, recent growth. I think with recent growth, you get a better watcher to uh, follow account. Because obviously, you know, a lot of people have just recently added you, and the smaller you are, the larger percentage of other new ads, new follows, who are actually... You know, still interested in watching you, I and mean, they're not just, you know, a residual thing. I think that might need an overpass. Let me check my snaz again, see if the numbers have updated. Apparently we're still on 499 followers. <laughs> Let me refresh my stream. I mean, we've had like three or four people in, and yet that number hasn't updated. And this is the number direct from Twitch. It checks every five seconds. So I don't get why, you know, refreshing my stream is actually going to do anything. And refreshing my stream, it says 498. Oh, for Christ's sake. I'm sure we're at over 500. 
<laughs> and spaghetti, it's a circle thing. Sp. Ah, get it. T T I. Oh wait, wait, uh, that's in the wrong place. It's a circle thing. Yep. You're right, it is no longer just it's a circle. It does need... Thank you for following! Seriously gaming. Okay, so this is working at basically peak efficiency. Because this is in the way. A lot of them are turning straight round, so let's try before they turn. Come on, straight line. Let's just give them the option to go straight across there. Now, if you were going just round that roundabout to come back down here, you no longer have to. That looks weird. Yep, some of them are using it. Which will hopefully cut down traffic on this again. It's going to, you know, cause more there, but, you know, it's fine. Well, if you're on holiday, you should just be sitting around in front of a computer screen. Sure, it's fine. <laughs> nah, go outside and have some fun, mate. Oh yeah, I remember this. Well, that did actually fix this junction. Almost. <laughs> yeah, I can't get anywhere near where I want to place that road. Not even when I'm not building it. Oh, that's in Tokyo. There's not a lot of outside to go to then. But it still sounds like fun. Okay, you're still being a problem there. Population wise, we've got up to 40,000. Now, this eventually I want turning down. So, into here. No, I didn't want you to go down. Stay elevated. So something like that. And can I follow you around with one curve? So close. Let's. <laughs> okay, curves are just stupid. Highway, you should be able to place down both of them at the same time. Let's use straight, because I, I, I can get a close facsimile to a curve with straight. And still keep them a reasonable distance apart. Although that's derpy as hell. And... Okay, which one of you is actually going the wrong way? It's this one. Which means... 
this wants to be connecting there for now. I just want to try and get roughly you know, what we're going to be building here, where we have space to build. Have I bought new land? Not recently. I've been avoiding it because we've got plenty of land to fill in. Like right, now, I'm going to try and fill in sort of this space here. Again, road. Sort of off there. Follow the highway. Straight along here, follow the railroad and the edge of a world. And I can probably take you to there. And I think we're connecting here. But also... Like off to that. Giving them two ways to connect. So this is sort of the land that we need to now... Oh, crap. Yeah, you're not connected. I guess something like this. Why we've got a ramp there, I have no idea, but it shouldn't affect it too much. So, how am I going to segregate this? Well, here I've just got the straight lines coming off that sort of equivalent road. So let's try something like that. Take a line down the middle here. Nice and straight. That junction. And have it curved there. Then I think... Cross hatching here. So cross hatching there. No, we can get another... Anyway, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, that is all the time we have for today. As always, I'd like to thank you for watching, though. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to say goodbye. Goodbye.